If you're following Depp and Heard after Virginia, you probably know Johnny was recently at the Cannes Film Festival and Amber was at a much smaller, lesser known festival I can't pronounce. You might also know that things about Amber and Johnny keep trending to this day. This hashtag I want to take a look at is called Amber's Not Worth It to contradict Amber's Worth It, which got around a little bit. So let's start here with this meme. This person ITF says a meme is born. And here's what it is. F those kids, I'm rich. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to say that officially is not very funny. I mean, if these people are trying to prove a point on Amber's side against Johnny fans mostly, isn't Johnny like 300 or 400 times richer than Amber or something? Let's keep going. And we've got more of the same things going around, which I think is a good thing to keep these narratives going that are the good narratives. This person, ATL, says that Amber fans unfortunately tend to stereotype all women. And that's my big problem. Look, stick to the people involved with the case. All they're trying to do is make their opinion mean more by saying all women. It's probably the worst thing we got out of this. Just stick with Little Miss Mera. And here's one from Nibs. Shout out to her, by the way. Who fixed one of Amber's statements? I destroyed my life as I knew it. The vilification I have faced on social media is an amplified version of the ways in which criminals are treated when they are caught. Good start. Now, I finally have an opportunity to emancipate myself from something I planned for six years and have no choice but to. They caught me red-handed. Everyone saw the trial. I can still spread lies, but Johnny will just have the verdict enforced, so don't hold your breath. Pretty good job. And someone puts this up here. While I'm not totally into this kind of thing, just making fun, once in a while, the occasional joke's okay, and this is a pretty good job where they've got all the accessories and everything. And here's the film festival in Sicily Amber was at, and the thing is, there's a lot of empty seats up there. I mean... If this was the big deal, everyone thought it was. It was the comeback of the century or whatever they say. Well, you'd think at least most of the seats would be full. And this here's from a Johnny fan, but they're pointing out that articles like this just keep getting around. Time has shown Amber to be the real winner, not wife beater Johnny. So what they're trying to do is outlast the Johnny crowd who criticized Amber and pointed out the facts about her. They're hoping the Johnny crowd goes away, thins out, so they can move this stuff out there and help Amber get back on her feet. That's why I keep saying, although things are regurgitated, although things are repeating, it's good to keep the narrative out there going that we know to be true. And this one got around of Amber sharing a pizza with one of the Simpsons. Well, maybe he's not one of the Simpsons, but I think some people might get my drift. And this person posts Johnny up there, some pretty good pictures actually, you'll never see Amber's associates using, and says she'd rather see this than hear things about Little Miss Mera. And most people would. But, as I just explained, which I won't again, gotta keep the good info out there. And this article here is an important one to keep going no matter what. It's the big reminder, Little Miss Mera arrested for DV against girlfriend. And according to this person, this is what Amber fans are really thinking. And that could be. And this one again, it looks like maybe even Johnny fans can use it to showcase how bad this meme is. Anyway, this goes on and on and on. It's still trending. June 28th, 2023. And Johnny Depp also is trending. It'll be pretty interesting to see when these trends stop because it's been going strong almost every day for a year with Johnny and Amber trends. Let me know what you think in the comments. I'm on Twitter too, maybe give me a follow. Just past 3,000 by a little bit. And if you're not subscribed here, consider it. If you don't, I'll be real sad about it. But if you do subscribe, well, then I'll see you next time.